oh my gosh hey guys welcome back to my channel i am so excited i have tried to record this video at least three or four different times but i am i'm, I'm excited and when i start talking i'm just I'm talking too much, I'm talking too fast, and it's a whole thing. So I apologize if you're watching this video and you're like, girl, you are all over the place. Y'all just gonna have to take this frantic energy today and you're also gonna have to take this voice. I am getting over some allergies that I've been having so my voice sounds a little ugh, but I feel fine. I'm just trying to get my voice back. But anyways, I'm jumping right into this video. I am doing a review or sharing my thoughts on the long-awaited album from J Electronica. It is called A Written Testimony. It is here, finally, 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 after all these years, we have a J Electronica album. So before I start the album, let me just briefly give you a little short backstory on J Electronica. I'm not like the super hip hop head. I'm just a girl who loves the arts, be it music, movies, television, theater. I love it all. I'm into it. I'm also a documentary girl. So I sit up and I watch all these documentaries. So I know a little bit. I know a little bit. But anyways, J Electronica is actually from New Orleans, Louisiana. Um, so he is a Southern boy. Uh, he is very well known inside of the industry. He hasn't released a solo album until now, but he's done a lot of really fire features. Um, he has a lot of really dope singles that, um, <clears throat> He has a release. I first found J Electronica back when I was in high school. I have always been, though I'm in the South, I'm in Houston, I've kind of always been into um, Northern rap, East Coast rap, even West Coast rap. And it was kind of weird because I didn't know too many other people that were into it growing up. Like everybody was on the Yin Yang Twins and all of that. And I was just like, oh, what about Jay-Z? Cause you know, I love Jay-Z, but I first heard of Jay Electronica back when I was in high school when he released Exhibit A and Exhibit C. And th this is the fire of Jay Electronica. Just with the singles that this man has released, he has gotten this title as being this absolutely amazing lyricist. There are some people who give him the title of being a hip hop legend. I mean, this man never dropped a studio album and some people consider him that. But that is just how fire and how good he is as far as his talent with hip hop. Um, so he released those two singles. He also had um, some other things he released like Act One, I know Style Wars. I'm not really familiar with the Style Wars. Um, I don't know why, I've heard it before, but I didn't hear that as much as I heard Act One, Exhibit A, and um, Exhibit C for whatever reason. But um, he ended up signing to Rock Nation, and once he signed to Rock Nation, everybody just knew, you know, that he was going to be releasing music, and nothing. We've just been waiting and waiting and waiting, and he's been on all these different songs, fire features. I mean, his verse on Control was amazing. Jay Electronica is the type of rapper that can go over your head. I like rap like that because I like to I like to think. Don't get me wrong, I like party music too. But overall I like to think, you know, because even when I listen to him, sometimes I'm like, wait, let me, you know, let me look that up. Like what did he just say? <laughs> Cause I don't know what that is. Let me Google it. But I learn a lot. I like when I can learn from the artists that I listen to, especially rappers. If you can make me Google something, if I gotta stop your song. Or wait to the end of your song and go Google something. I like you. I like you because I'm learning from you. I like to learn from people. But yeah, anyways, we just been waiting for his album. Waiting, 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 waiting. And nothing. Just features, little singles here and there, but nothing. He would drop something and kind of pull back. And that would be the end of it. We wouldn't hear from him. So he's a bit, he's garnered this like reputation as almost being like a myth. Like is Jay Electronica even real? I mean, I don't know. Like it, it, he's just been like this urban legend. Like, okay, obviously we know that he's real, but we've just been waiting for his album. And finally we got it um, March 13th, which was yesterday. Um, we got the album. So let's jump into the album now, now, guys. I listened to the album four times. Four times. Let me explain. This is just my personal thing. I think you need to listen to an album more than once to really get a full critique. Or maybe it's just me. Number one, I'm a beats girl. So when I first hear a, um, a song or album, I'm listening to the melodies. I'm listening to the instruments. Cause I love live music. I love instruments. I love all of that. So when I first hear songs, that's what I'm listening to first. So the first time I may kind of focus on that. The second time I may be more into the lyrics. 
around the third time I'm getting the vibe seeing you know can I drive to it how I feel about that and then the fourth time I may be kind of refining my thoughts on it and that's exactly what I did so the first time I was listening to it I really 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 got caught up in the beat so let me start there the production I love I love the production on the album I love the beats I love the melodies um, I think they're awesome I think they're really, really, really good. Also, the lyrical content, I love. I mean, it's Jay. We, I mean, did we expect anything less? Like, we expected there to be some lyrical content of substance on there. And that's what uh, he gave us. My favorite song, oh my gosh, someone else asked me this. And I'm saying someone else, like somebody just asked me. But um, it's hard for me to pick. Um, but I do really like... Um, a never ending story and the ghost of soldier slim and i also like the very very last um track on the album a p i d t a um it's an acronym and um it's just about death and as being someone who has lost a parent that last track really 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 resonated with me and i love it lots of um good verses on that one good bars on that one so overall i like the album um I listen, like I said, I listened to it the first time, and I guess I can get into the kind of, uh, I don't know if this is a con or if this is just a critique, but the first time I'm listening to it, I'm washing dishes, and I literally had to look up because I'm like, am I still listening to Jay Electronica or am I listening to Jay-Z? There, there's a lot of Jay-Z. Jay-Z is all over this album and it threw me off because I didn't, I wasn't anticipating that. I wasn't anticipating that. When I first heard Jay-Z, I was like, <clears throat> okay, all right. But then I heard him again and I'm like, wait, <laughs> you know, what's going on? Um, <clears throat> that I, I don't really care for because we've waited so long to hear from Jay Electronica. And then the thing is, We've heard you features. We've heard you, you know, on other people's, like, projects. So, I think, like, we, we want to hear you by yourself. So, the amount of Jay-Z was a little bit overwhelming. I'm just going to be honest. Um, it wasn't my, my favorite thing. And I love Jay-Z. I appreciate Jay-Z's um, content. First of all, can we just take a moment to... Uh, give a round of applause to Jay-Z and the growth that he is experiencing as an artist. I, I love it. Jay-Z is my GOAT. He's my greatest of all time. So <clears throat> I'm not complaining about Jay-Z as if I don't like him. I just wanted to hear more of Jay Electronica on his own. That's my only thing. Um, but other than that, I really, really love the album. The second time I listened to the album, I was just kind of chilling and hanging out. <clears throat> on the computer getting a vibe for it then the third time I listened to the album I was driving because the album is short it's only about 39 minutes it's only 10 songs so I was driving the whole album played to my destination from my destination that was a whole album because I wanted to see how it felt as I was riding I'm, I'm that girl I want to you know vibe with it when I'm in the car and I loved it um I probably would go back to the album I know some people feel like yeah you know it'll just go away and it's all right it's but you know I, I liked it my only critique that I would say is that we could have done without all of the Jay-Z that's my only thing I would have loved to her to hear more of Jay on there by himself that's pretty much the only critique that I really can think of with the album but overall I liked it why don't you guys tell me what you think? Um, like I said, Jay Electronica, he is, he's amazing. Like, I'm i am trying to like, really contain myself because I really, really love him as a lyricist, especially being someone from New Orleans. No tea, no shade because I have family in New Orleans and I love New Orleans. But a lot of rappers that come out of New Orleans, they don't rap the way that he does. You know, he has a lot of substance and that's not something that we see quite often from the rappers in New Orleans so it's a little different and I love it so overall congratulations to Jay Electronica we are happy for you congratulations to Rock Nation to Jay-Z the whole brand the whole company we are so happy I actually saw um 
on somebody's Instagram where um, he, he was up in Times Square, that his album was out, and I thought that was so amazing. So overall, I'm excited for it. I'll probably play the album again. I can see myself listening to it every now and then when I'm vibing and things like that. So I'm happy. How about you tell me what you guys think about it? Was it too much Jay-Z for you? Do you think Jay, uh, Jay should have been on his own a little bit more? Let me know. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, and share this video. If you know anybody else that likes hip-hop, likes Jay Electronica, share it. I want to hear you guys' feedback. I want to hear how y'all feel about it, guys. But that's all I have to say. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.